the ancient Egyptian civilization stands as one of the most extraordinary cultures of the ancient world. In fields such as art, architecture, and science, they were far more advanced than other contemporary civilizations, to the extent that modern historians often struggle to comprehend the origins of their knowledge. Indeed, many ancient Egyptian discoveries leave scientists baffled. The rulers of ancient Egypt, known as pharaohs, constructed intricate monuments and tombs, immortalizing their names and achievements in hieroglyphs. Ancient Egypt holds many secrets, including the tomb of an unknown queen, a temple with cryptic messages and vast tunnels beneath the temple. Here are some recent astonishing discoveries from ancient Egypt that have left scientists awestruck. The statue of Sekhmet, currently housed in the Egyptian gallery at the Royal Ontario Museum, is a life-size statue of one of the oldest known Egyptian deities. Her name comes from the Egyptian word Sekhem, meaning power, often translated as the Mighty One. She is also known as the Lady of Terror. Sekhmet is typically depicted as a fierce lioness. However, this particular statue is intriguingly different and somewhat unsettling. Scientists have found a representation of Sekhmet that is far more human-like and gentle. They believe this is one of the earliest depictions of the goddess ever discovered. Researchers suggest that this statue, dating back to the 11th dynasty, is a rare example of religious art from that period, which was mostly represented by small amulets. This indicates that the ancient Egyptians had a more sophisticated understanding of the goddess and her powers than previously thought. The statue of Sekhmet looks strikingly different from usual depictions of Sekhmet, as it was found within the Great Pyramid of Giza, built during the same period. Scientists propose it was placed inside the pyramid as an offering to the goddess, likely by the king who ordered its construction. Despite being buried for over 4,000 years, its condition remains remarkably intact. Archaeologists have discovered a secret repository of sacred animals in a newly found tomb near Luxor. This tomb was uncovered in the Dra el Naga necropolis, which is home to a series of tombs from the New Kingdom period, spanning the 16th to 11th centuries BCE. The repository contains nine mummified birds and kittens. Researchers found these mummified animals in a chamber within the central room of the tomb. The chamber also housed a large wooden statue of a man named Puyu. This man was likely a high-ranking priest who lived around 3,000 years ago. Researchers believe these animal mummies were placed in the chamber as offerings to Puyu by mourners. Some animals were wrapped in linen cloth, while others were placed in clay pots. Many of the animals were adorned with gold and silver. Some even had gemstones embedded in their bodies. The team, led by the Egyptian Ministry of Antiquities, will continue excavating the tomb. They hope to uncover more clues about Puyu's life and his role in ancient Egyptian society. A team of Czech archaeologists led by the Czech Institute of Egyptology has made a fascinating discovery, the tomb of a previously unknown queen. This discovery took place in the Old Kingdom necropolis southwest of Cairo Abusir, which houses Pharaoh Neferefri's tomb. The tomb, found within Neferefri's burial complex, is believed to belong to his queen or possibly his wife. In an article published by The Guardian, Egypt's Minister of Antiquities, Mamdu El Damati, named the Queen Kentakawes III, stating, It is the first time we have discovered the name of a queen unknown from historical records before the discovery of her tomb. The tomb dated to the mid-5 of the dynasty, about 2994 to 2345 BCE, contains inscriptions identifying its owner as a wife of the king. Archaeologists also unearthed about 30 limestone and copper utensils. 
According to team leader Miroslav Barta, this discovery is significant, highlighting that the Abusir necropolis provides unique resources for reconstructing the grand history of ancient Egypt. The iconic ancient Egyptian death masks are among the most treasured artifacts. These masks were placed over the faces of mummies to ensure they could be recognized in the afterlife. However, recent findings reveal that death masks were not always made of gold, but sometimes from meteorite fragments. Ruling pharaohs, such as Tutankhamun, wore death masks, but archaeologists discovered that Tutankhamun's mask was not made of gold. This finding challenges our understanding of ancient Egyptian practices. Meteorites, rare in Egypt, were used to create artifacts reserved exclusively for pharaohs. The most famous and mysterious is Pharaoh Tutankhamun's dagger, along with other items found in his tomb, including a pendant made from meteorite fragments. However, the pendant in the tomb does not match the one depicted on his death mask, suggesting some treasures might have been stolen during his lifetime or shortly after his death and replaced with similar items. This explains why the origin of one of these rare pendants remained a secret for so many years. Archaeologists have uncovered a massive ancient stone tunnel beneath the Taposiris Magna Temple, located west of Alexandria, Egypt. This discovery was announced by Egypt's Ministry of Tourism and Antiquities in 2022. A team led by Dr. Kathleen Martinez from the University of Santo Domingo found the tunnel during their search for Queen Cleopatra's tomb. Archaeologists describe the tunnel as a geometric miracle, extending more than 4,300 feet and carved into rock 42 feet underground within the temple area. The Taposiris Magna Temple is dedicated to Osiris, the Egyptian god of the underworld. During previous excavations at the site, researchers discovered significant artifacts, including coins bearing the images and names of Queen Cleopatra and Alexander the Great. They also found several beheaded statues and a statue of the goddess Isis, revered as the ideal mother and wife, as well as a goddess of nature and magic. One of the most perplexing discoveries in Egypt is an unusual electromagnetic field, described as unique in the world. This field was found at the Temple of Hathor in Dendera, nearly 100 kilometers from the Nile River. The temple is believed to have had a series of copper arrows above its entrance, which created a special electromagnetic field used to repel insects. This theory is supported by the fact that the copper arrows have been missing since Napoleon invaded Egypt in 1798. Interestingly, the scientists who discovered this field were baffled because there is no similar electromagnetic field anywhere else in the world. They were even unable to identify the type of field as it remains unknown. This discovery is particularly puzzling because the ancient Egyptians had an advanced understanding of magnetism and electromagnetism. Its presence has sparked numerous studies and analyses, including from the French Institute in Cairo, which is currently investigating how most people in Egypt knew how to create such fields. There are many more mysterious and fear-inducing discoveries in ancient Egypt that continue to baffle scientists. These include hidden tunnels beneath the Pyramid of Giza, the Serapium of Saqqara, Khufu's secret chambers, the Silver Pharaoh's tomb, the Ark of the Covenant, the Mummy's Cache, and the Tomb of the Pyramid Builders. We will discuss these in more detail another time.